Today we're going to be taking a look at the best hitch options for your 2013 Nissan Xterra. The hitches we'll be looking at are the Kurt Class 3 hitch, part number 13514, and the Draw Tight Class 3 hitch, part number 75291. The first major difference that we're going to see between these two hitches are when the Kurt's on there, it's a little bit more aesthetically pleasing than the Draw Tight, just with the way that this reinforcement collar is made and the plate that's along the top just helps give it a little bit cleaner look. Another major difference that you're going to see between these two is the safety chain connection points. Down here on the draw tight, we've got the plate style with the oval holes cut in them. And those give us pretty good access for a lot of safety chain connections. But up here on the Kurt, we've got the rolled steel safety chain connections. And those are going to give us a lot more access. And if we've got larger safety chains, they should be a little bit easier to connect on the Kurt safety chain connections. Another difference between these two is on the draw tight, it features a 350 pound max tongue weight rating and a 3,500 pound gross trailer weight rating. Whereas on the Kurt, it features a 400 pound max tongue weight rating and a 4,000 pound gross trailer weight rating. But then when you switch to weight distribution, the Kurt has a 600 pound max tongue weight rating and a 6,000 pound gross trailer weight rating. Whereas with weight distribution on the draw tight, it only goes up to 550 pounds max tongue weight and 5,500 pound gross trailer weight. And when towing, you do want to be sure to refer to your owner's manual to make sure that your vehicle is capable of that type of weight. Both of these hitches are going to install the same way, with the same mounting points on either side. One thing that we're going to see down here on the draw tight that the Kurt doesn't have is this extra half inch hole. And what that's going to be used for is if you've already got a J-pin stabilization system for some accessory that you have, this draw tight is going to be able to work with that. Here on this Xterra, we've got the Kurt installed, and it's got that plate across the top, like I had mentioned before, that just helps with aesthetics. And overall, it maintains a nice heavy duty, sturdy look on this vehicle, but doesn't take away from the overall look of this vehicle. Something else that's nice about this plate up top is that if absolutely necessary, when you've got a roof rack or something like that on, you could use that as a step if needed. But overall, this hitch is going to do really well for you because it's nice and sturdy, but also with the amount of clearance that it gives you, it's going to be able to work well for just about any accessory that you may have. We hope this helps in the decision-making process for a hitch for your Nissan. Click the link below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com.